Hey, Rob, uh, just dealing with that wind that Larry was talking about out here, just taking off my mask. But you know what we have here is finally something that has gone from concept to fruition. And it took seven years to bring a hotel here to Navy Pier. This is the Sable Hotel at Navy Pier, and hopefully it's a harbinger of good things to come. The past year, it took a lot of faith, really, to keep going from one day to the next. But sometimes an entrepreneur just has to trust his gut. 40 years a hotelier, Bob Abib had to keep the cash flowing on this $100 million sable at Navy Pier to complete construction of Chicago's newest hotel last November. The pandemic delayed opening night. How hard has it been to hold this through since November? Uh, it's been very difficult. I mean, I think everyone in the hotel industry in Chicago would, would take last year uh, and, and give it away if we could. It's been a very difficult year. In a business where 60% occupancy is the line for profit, but 20% has been the norm during the pandemic, this sprawling 223-room, five-story affair is a bet on Chicago's future with a nautical theme saluting Navy Pier and an aircraft carrier docked here during the war. So what we have here is a 70-story building lying on its side. What kind of construction challenges did that pose? Well, if you think about it, we're building a seven-story hotel on a pier that was originally constructed in 1916, for which very few plans still exist. The Illinois Hotel and Lodging Association says industry revenues won't hit pre-pandemic levels until 2024. I think there's the, the light at the end of the tunnel is there, albeit a very dim light right now. But with an all-Chicago development team, there's a hometown pride in Sable, something they hope propels success. The views are unbelievable. Every room faces south. Every room has floor-to-ceiling windows. On a clear day, you can see from this guest room to Michigan City. And you can see Michigan City from these windows that you're taking a look at live right now. They, all the rooms are actually facing east and uh, basically south. And uh, that is part of the design structure for this. Can you imagine this promenade full of people coming up, maybe having a drink on the promenade and the cafe here related to the hotel? This is something that is all about the future. And it's all made possible because somebody took a bet a long time ago. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.